I saw something weird on my flight actually. It was like I was on a plane and uh, it was actually on the on the way back from Adelaide and there was this family two seats down in front of me, right? And I was in the like aisle seat and there's this kid and as we like took off, he just started moaning like in pain. He's just like, Ugh, and you're just like, oh, shut the fuck up, right? And he's like two seats in front and his dad's sitting next to him. His dad's a big burly bloke and obviously his missus is next to him and he's like sitting there and he's just like trying to tell his kid to shut up. He's like, shut the fuck up. And I saved up all this money to get this jet stuff flight. Then your mother to go to fucking Adelaide with Colin home. Shut up. You know, the kid keeps going and going and he goes, fine, fine. I'll talk to the lady, fine. And he asks the hostess over and like they have a little conversation about what's going on. They look at the kid and he's like, uh. And then she walks up to the front of the plane, gets the microphone that beams down the plane, right? And she goes, attention passengers, is there a dentist on board? <laughs> and I was like, you can fucking do that. Like you can, like I understand doctor, but we can go other professions. Like we can, like if you got a masseuse, that'd be nice. Got a bung knee, is there a physio on board? My knee's a little bit sore. Like, what the fuck? Are you, what, you can just choose whatever you want to ask for now? I was amazed. It was like, I didn't know, like fuck the seat only goes back this far. What the fuck's a dentist gonna do? Like. I sat there like gobsmacked, and then a guy behind me goes, I'm a dentist. I'm like, what? <laughs> what is this flight? You know what I mean? I'm a dentist, and this guy got up with the fucking so much confidence. Like, this has made this dentist's fucking life. <laughs> like, you'd think I'm gonna tell this story a lot. Imagine this prick. Like, every dinner, you wouldn't fucking believe it, on the plane, is there a dentist on board? Don't worry, fucking nailed it. Gave that kid a feeling, boom, landed the plane safe. All good, I'm a fucking hero. He was walking down the aisle and you could just tell in his mind, he's just like, I fucking told you, mum. I told you I'm a doctor, mum. I told you I'm a doctor, just like my brother. You're not a doctor, Darren. I'm a fucking doctor. <laughs> I watched this whole thing happen. I was like, this is amazing. And there's not even a, like, it's not even a crazy end to this. I'll tell you how it ended. He sat down. He looked at the kid, right? They had a little chat back and forth. The dad actually moved and he sat next to the kid for a bit. They went back and forth. And then he calls the hostess over and he goes, have you got any Panadol? <laughs> I was like, a fucking doctor could have done that, bro. Like, you know what I mean? Why would we call the dentist if that was the solution? Like, you know what I mean? Like, it was outrageous. He got up, he left. The guy, the like, dad comes back. The kid sits down. He has some ice and shit. He sits there for a bit. We're only an hour into the flight, right? And this is how you know the kid was a little shit. Because half an hour later, fine. <laughs> Not a problem with him. He's fine, he's playing with his brother, he's drawing on crayons, and the dad is like, hmm. And what had happened was, was like, while this was going on, the hostess had gone and organised an ambulance for the kid to be picked up, and the dad's just watching this kid being like, you little fuck. He's like, oh, listen, man, we're not going to need the ambulance anymore. I think my kid is actually fucking fine. Thank the dentist. Hopefully he bulk bills, you know. <laughs> and the hostess goes, oh, I'm sorry, sir. Once we've booked an ambulance, we can't unbook the ambulance. You're going to have to pay for it, and you're the first ones to get off the flight. And this man fucking cracked it. <laughs> he goes, you know when someone's, like, fucking pissed off? And he's like, but, he, but they don't want to look pissed off in front of the person? He's like, thank you. <laughs> and as soon as that bat turned, he's like, you little fucking shit, you fucking gonna cost me... $300, you fucking teeth, you think your teeth hurt now? We're gonna fucking hurt when we get off the plane! And I'm like, someone get that dentist, because I reckon he's gonna have some work on this kid's teeth when we land. <laughs>